What is going on everyone? Sir James coming to you guys with another video and for this video I like to share with you guys what I got at my local GameStop. So uh, I got one PC game, I got an Xbox 360 game and I pre-ordered Assassin's Creed 4 and got this pretty cool looking double sided poster which I'll take out and show you guys towards the end of this video. So uh, but before I go to that for those of you who missed it I do have an unboxing video from this morning for the Razer Deathstalker which I got. It's a pretty sweet keyboard. I have it out in front of you guys. Just giving you guys another quick glimpse for those of you who missed it. This keyboard right here. And uh, I've been using it for, for a few hours because like I said, I got it this morning and I love this keyboard. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I think it's a really sweet keyboard for 80 bucks. I think I spent pretty good money on this. So uh, I'm happy with my purchase. But anyways, let's go ahead and move on. So let's go ahead and start with the PC game. The PC game I got, which was going for $5, is called Rift. Now, I don't know if... I know this is an MMORPG. I don't know if this is a free-to-play or a pay-to-play. Where's my control scheme? So yeah, let me go ahead and give you guys a closer look. That's a really cool-looking title. Like I said, this was $5 at GameStop. Uh, this cover opens up right here. I saw some videos on it and it looks like a really gorgeous looking game. So, uh, you know, I decided why not check it out. So, like I said, it's new, so it's in its plastic sleeve. And there's some good amount of weight on this, so it must come with like a large manual or something. So, uh, let's go ahead and just open this up and uh, see what we're getting inside. And of course, too, uh, tonight is the midnight release for the Gears of War Judgment. Uh, I won't be picking it up yet, uh, hopefully soon on my next pay, but I will be going there to film the midnight launch, hopefully do some interviews and things like that. So, uh, so yeah, there's the front cover. There's the back. Let me go ahead and fix that. So if you guys want to get a chance to read that. So inside... You're getting, a, it's on a single disc. And all the weights coming over here where these booklets are. So let's see what they have here. Okay, well, what, what the hell is this? Okay, so here is the uh, quick start guide. Really thick booklet. This is what it's mostly weighing it down. And you got this little cool little flip out book that goes over the keyboard functions. And it opens up showing you guys, I guess, combats. Movement, chat, or uh, yeah, the functions of the keyboard basically what it's showing you. So pretty cool. And the manual is in color as well. So for those of you that like color manuals like I do. So pretty cool. Like I said, it looked like an interesting game. There's another thing in here. I'm not sure what this is. This looks like a poster. And a map. Sweet. So you're getting a uh, poster as well of the what's on the main cover. And there's also on the back a map of, I guess, this one. I know there's expansion packs for the game as well. So I have not played Rift before. This is going to be my first time actually trying it out. So that caught my interest. I don't know if it's a yeah, free-to-play or if it's a pay-to-play MMO. But it looks really cool. And I know there's expansions. Hopefully it's free-to-play. Or, but anyways, we're going to see. I'll probably check that out after I get back from the Gears of War Judgment Midnight Launch. So that's the PC game I got. The Xbox 360 game I got is the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I know some of you guys mean like, oh, it's Call of Duty. Huh. Fuck, little kids play that game. I know, alright? It's liter It's pretty much full of little kids that are knowing as how I mute most people in Call of Duty than any game I've ever played. So I'm mostly a Battlefield guy, but I've been in the mood to play Modern Warfare 2. That's why I got it. It was like eight bucks, so I wasn't gonna say no. And now is the Assassin's Creed 4 poster that I got just for pre-ordering the game. Just simple five bucks down. I'm waiting for them to announce a collector's edition. Hopefully soon. I'm hoping they do a collector's edition. I mean, it's obviously they got to because they've been doing one for the past Assassin's Creed games. So I know these posters are extremely li limited, so if you really want one of these, I suggest you go to a local GameStop as soon as possible. Uh, what guys do you want to start with? Let's go ahead and start with the map side. So 
So here is side A. Really cool. I guess that's the map of where the game is taking place. I'm, I'm assuming. And side B. This one's a really cool looking one. Fix that up for you guys. And then uh, down here it says Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. It looks like a really sweet, it's a sweet poster. I'm not gonna lie, it's an awesome poster. Don't wanna ruin it. So yeah, double sided poster. I, I almost wanna get another one so I could, you know, put it on both sides. So that, that's the poster. Really cool, like I said, that's, I'm not sure if any other stores are doing that, but I know if you go to GameStop pre-order it, simple five bucks. Boom, you get the poster. Like I said, got Modern Warfare 2, eight bucks. No big deal, just been in the mood playing Modern Warfare 2, so that. And like I said, I got Rift, it was five bucks, and it looks like a really cool and interesting game. That's why I got that. But anyways, that's it for this video. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave that in the comment section down below, and you guys enjoy the rest of your day.